Beloved in Christ, there's a question that I have been asking myself um, from what I'm observing in this earth today. Something that is different from the years past in my journey as a pastor, as an evangelist, as a teacher of God's word amongst professing Christians or believers. And this is the question, why are there so many angry Christians or professing Christians? Beloved, I have not seen so much anger amongst Christians than I've ever seen before in my life. I mean, you can just bring up certain conversation and talk to believers. And it's as though you're starting World War III. Beloved, I do not believe that this is proper or this is right. Because I believe if a Christian truly is centered on God's will, they recognize that anger that continues on in sometimes physical violence is not of God. Beloved, the joy of the Lord is our strength. And beloved, when we're walking in the joy of the Lord, that does not mean we're walking in a giddy spirit and we are not serious about what is happening in the earth today. But beloved, we come to a part to realize this is what God is allowing to happen in the earth today. And says he knows that this is not our home, beloved. He is not going to fix this world so that we can believe or walk in this world as though it is now comfortable to us. And I feel as though many times that's what believers believe that they deserve. Beloved, that is not what the scripture says. Nehemiah 8.10 says, The joy of the Lord is our strength. That's what our strength is. And when we are walking and displaying that joy, beloved, we can come in communion with one another as believers and we're not fighting and scuffling and battling and disagreeing with one another as many do today. Jesus said learn of me and who I am. I am meek. I am lowly. My weight and burden is light. And beloved when we walk that way and we acknowledge Jesus for who he is and the Holy Spirit who is our guide then beloved then we can walk in the joy of the Lord and when we walk in the joy of the Lord then we walk in the strength of the Lord and any difficulties that we face beloved we are able to deal with it because we are walking in the joy of the Lord Beloved, let us investigate ourselves and see that we are walking in the joy of the Lord rather than the anger that this world sometimes tries to draw out of us. Beloved, as the word says, it's not what goes into the body, but what cometh out of the mouth that defiles the believer. 
Beloved, be blessed this day and walk in the joy of the Lord this week.